Okay, well there there's another van that's got the, the main crew leader. Okay, so let's give us a hand. We need to prepare. Yeah, okay, thank you. So all this is washed out, so to yeah, say. Yeah, I mean, it, you know. That's I'll, terrible. Yeah, I mean, all this is this whole patch. I would say it probably got about a <laughs> but yeah, normal 85% germination oh, rate because I tested them in um, trays. Okay. But, uh, so I, I, I know what my, you know, I looked at the COAs and things like that. So, you know. Right. Yeah, but you still can't tell. So it actually it goes down here. That hill is the one that you can see. It actually goes down past that house, past that house. So it goes almost down to that flat, that tree line. That's wow. what 60 acres is. Right. So it's a chunk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This, this is a chunk. No kidding. You know? 60 acres of hemp. 60 acres of auto to stout from Colorado and the oh, cool. guy who I got the seed from grows 800 acres like this and has three different crews of 20 people culling the males wow. and, and weeding so you know this is that's seven there's another group somewhere else and, you know, Endless battle, but I was kind of like, well, let's see what it does. Right. And I'll, you know, keep keeping track of where they're working to, you know, to see if how far the pollen spreads, if you can kind of control the area. I don't think, I mean, even though pollen can go six, five miles, mm -hmm. it may only affect you know, a hundred foot radius in a valley. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. I don't know if you've noticed the mileage difference, but I kept all my fields five. I kept this field five miles from that field, seven miles from that field, uh. another field that's all the industrial, what I call industrial hemp is also seven miles away. So I had all my fields in a large circle basically. Uh. Yeah, it was kind of fragmented, but yeah, I guess there is some rhyme and reason. Oh yeah, yeah. and the and the, the other very good looking field, the feminized one with the pivot, that's just a half a mile away from the the second field that you went to with the, the plastic. Yeah. So I kept my mm -hmm. feminized plots together. Sure. And then like I said, I had an issue with another farmer that was going to farm, you know, about a less than a mile away and I convinced him to move fields where I was growing my industrial hemp mm -hmm. on the other 50 acres so our, our fields are together and they won't affect each other sure Yet I kept that five yeah. miles away from the greenhouse seven miles away from my feminized seed and away from my uh, two acre plot that I'm growing mother plants and clones for seed stock. That's the greenhouse. Well, they were in the greenhouse, and I've moved them all. My niece planted them, the final plants. Did you see it too, Laura? The, no, I haven't seen where she planted. Okay. We haven't been to Anderson's yet. Anderson's. 